Hey guys, so I got this solar powered light. It's um, supposedly can be inside the water, so I'm gonna test it out for my pond. Okay. Underwater solar spotlight. Let's see how this works. So we got the instructions, we got these items right here. This okay, got a couple of things here. This is a solar panel, a cable I got. Things with a plastic on top. Mm, I hope it's not gonna affect it. It looks pretty, it doesn't look right. Not sure what that is. I hope it still works though. Okay. I'm going to turn off my pond because it's making so much sound. Okay. So... Okay, I should probably read the instructions first. I guess... I'm guessing one is... This is for the... The solar panel. Okay, this is... Okay, I think you have to... Adjust it here. Like, the angle. This goes right here. Okay, so this is like if you want it to be inside the water, and then this is like if you want to set it up outside. So you, you know, you do this, set it up outside, but I want it to be underwater, so I'm just gonna use this. Okay. So then we're gonna connect these. I do apologize about my nails. I was working on my pond yesterday and kind of messed up my nails. Okay, so I'm not really sure what these things are for. Okay, so here it says turn. Make sure to turn on the switch before use. The solar panel should face south. And free from like obstructions such as buildings, trees, fences, bushes, or shadows to get enough sunlight. So turn on the button. Okay. So you have buttons here. Okay, turn it on. Alright, the product is light sensitive and won't light up in bright places. It will only light up in dark places. If you want to turn on the light in the daytime, you need to fully cover the solar panel and make sure there's no light source or sunshine detected. Choose an outdoor location away from the other, other light source at night such as street lights. Okay, so this works for me because I just wanted to light up at night. So I just have it charging all day and at night it will light up. But like the instructions say, if you want it to light up in the day, you're going to have to cover your panel somehow. Okay, um, let's see anything else I might need. Nope. I'm not really sure what these are for. I'm guessing this is like if you want to put in the wall. Um, yeah, I guess this is for the wall. You'll, if it's for the wall, then I guess you will screw in the nails. And you have this for the wall. This goes inside the wall. And this to make sure it doesn't fall down. See, it has... It has um, the only reason I know is because I have to hang up frames. Because I, I am an artist, so I have... Um, paintings that I hang up sometimes but yeah this goes inside the wall and this is to prevent it from from falling down and you know, it keeps it secure this actually you know opens up when you when you put the nail in and then the nail goes in but I'm guessing so you have to like set this up first and you're gonna set this up here you're gonna screw it in like that and then once you have that in the wall that you want it to place you will you slide this in and then that would be like right there where you want it to be but I don't really need that I just want this to be inside the pond on this on the floor I don't mind and it does angle up so I can put it in any angle I want 
pretty excited for it. It looks pretty good. So I'm going to let it charge all day. I'm going to update a night um, whether it works or not. And there's also modes here. Not really sure what that's for, but I mean, once it's charged up, I'm going to test out what the mode means. But it doesn't really say it here. But I'll let you guys know. Yeah, it looks pretty good. If it doesn't charge up in a day, I'm going to leave it like another day and then update with you guys. But I mean, according to all this, it should work just by charging one day. I do live in Florida, so there's a lot of sun here. I'm going to make sure this is like somewhere where the sun hits it a lot so I can charge up. This does look a little beat up. I'm not sure that's how they all come, but this is like the glue is still there. You can still see the glue. It's kind of like, it looks like somebody just glued it. And it is like some glue or something melted on top of there. It kind of sucks that it came like that. But if it works, I don't mind. Alright, so let's test this out. And I guess if you want to angle this, you're going to have to unscrew this a little bit. And then you can angle it because you can't angle it normally otherwise. I have something else where you could just angle it and it's like an air stone bubbler it works great but this um this um it's pretty tight in so i'm guessing you have to unscrew it and then angle it the way you want it to be if you want it it angled because the sun hits it more a certain way but uh, i'm gonna just try it out like this and see how it goes if i need to angle it i'll i'll screw it unscrew it a little bit angle it and then screw it back on <coughs> screw it back on so let's see how this works Okay, so I've got this set up over here. It's on this pot. Um, a lot of sun does hit this spot. So I'm just going to have it right there. And this is going to go inside. It doesn't go that far distance, but um, for me it works. Yeah, I'm going to put it right there. I'm just going to put it in there. Okay, so the sun is setting. It's 740. It's going to be nighttime. Let's check out the pond. Oh, the light is working. Okay, so it's been a couple of hours and the light seems to be working. That's great. So, it's working, it's pretty dark outside, so... Yeah. It does light up the pond. I'm going to angle it, see how it looks under here. Look how cool that looks. That's pretty cool. Must say. Okay, so it's about 6.45 a.m. and as you see, it's still lighting up. It lasts all night long. Okay, so I'm just going to test out the mode. I'm going to press on the buttons and um, let's see what happens. Okay, so I'm going to test out if we um, cover this, if the light will turn on. Okay, so I'm just going to put it back on my shirt and see if anything happens. 
nothing. So that's see, that's like right there being covered by um, the sunlight. So you cover the panel and it does light up. It's um about eleven twenty. So this charges up pretty good. And it was on all night. Pretty cool. And uh, let's see the mode. So So this mode is like a blinking one. This one's just normal. And this is brighter. Hey fish lovers! So I just wanted to let you know that I'm very grateful for all the support you've been showing on my videos. It really motivates me to make more. And if you haven't seen the video where I renovated my pond, you can click on the clip above. And if you haven't seen the video where I made my biofilter, you can click on the video below. Thank you for the love of goldfish.